First news is your local election headquarters. We've been previewing races and issues leading up to the March 19th primary. Tonight, the levy that will be on ballots throughout Columbiana County, requesting more money for the county's parks, a levy voters that have said no to twice. Here's First News reporter Jacob Thompson. Since 2020, the Columbiana County Park District has tried to pass a levy twice. Previously, three townships and a village weren't included in the vote. Now the number of voters have grown. So now when we went to the ballot, it's all of Columbiana County will vote on the levy and pay the levy. It's 0.35 mills over five years, costing the owner of a $100,000 home $12.25 a year. This will give the park district over $800,000 a year. It will go mainly towards the maintenance and upgrades of the Greenway Trail, Scenic Vista, and Hellbender Bluff Parks. Hellbender has neither electric or water available in the park. I think we'd like to run some electricity to our pavilion there. Including culvert work at the Greenway Trail and improvements to their water system at Scenic Vista. Both park board members say the parks will help homeowners. Adjacent lands, adjacent properties, increase in property value because of that preserved property next door to your, to your preserved property. Since 2011, the Park District had funding through the natural gas boom. The Park District does get $15,000 a year from the county commissioners. That $15,000 does also does not cover the utility costs. It does not cover the cost of the Porta Johns out there on the bike trails. The Porta Johns themselves are, are that much money. Uh, around $15,000 a year. We probably have enough money to maintain the status quo through 2025, and then it's going to be some serious, serious heart-wrenching decisions on where we go from here. As of now, the Park District has around $100,000 in the bank. In Columbiana County, Jacob Thompson, WKBN 27 First News. Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel and don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.